objects are, and officials are speculating. The objects seen in the various clips are unidentified aerial phenomena. <laughs> Hey guys, in this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to create this cool levitation effect using Adobe After Effects. Let's get started. To recreate this effect we need 3 shots, a background shot and 2 green screen shots. For the first one, just stand on the ground and pretend the levitation. For the second, let your legs swing in the air. We are gonna combine these two shots together. So let's open up After Effects. I place the background shot on the bottom of the timeline. And above that we have our green screen legs and body. First select the green screen body layer and grab the pen tool. Then create a mask around the body, but leave out your legs. Now enable animation for the mask path and animate the mask. Once this is done, search for key light effect and apply to the green screen shot. Use the picker tool and remove the green screen. Then choose intermediate result and apply advanced spill suppressor effect. Next select the green screen legs layer and draw a mask around the legs using pen tool. Again enable animation for the mask path and animate the mask. After that remove the green screen with key light effect. Now reposition the green screen layers and match them together. You might also need to animate the position to make the green screen layers stick together. Try to be as precise as you can. And also remember to save your project because After Effects can crash sometimes. Now we can pre-compose these two clips. Then enable animation for the position and animate it to make the body go out of the frame. To make the animation smoother, right click the keyframe and choose Easy Ease Out and Easy Ease In. Then I duplicated the background shot and made masks around the shoes to make it blend better with the background. For the light beam create a new solid layer, choose the color and set the blending mode to add. Create a shape with the pen tool and feather out the mask. Lastly add glow effect and animate the shape. And that's it. If you like this tutorial please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. I'll see you in the next one.